Cherry S. Team Nola still street races, but I don't think many others do. The th like, I mean, does he even Nola? Because, like... I mean, honestly, like, how many of these guys still do? And I'm not saying this in a negative light. I that I don't want that to this to come across as, as if I'm saying a negative thing. But when when would they? Like, you know what I mean? When would these guys be able to go out to, like, a real street race and race? I'm looking rough right now. I was just rubbing my eyes. I'm looking at myself. My, I look like a ghost right now. Forget how I look, ladies and gentlemen. We're talking about the real street racers still on Street Outlaws. Because you look at someone like like Sean, for example, or Dave, or Ryan. Like, we don't see them running on the real streets because we see them with we see them with their schedule. And it's like, when would they? They got no prep kings throughout the whole summertime. At the very beginning of the year, there's the street filming. Then after that street filming, they get ready for no prep kings. And then after no prep kings, normally, at least how it was last year, was like holiday season. They cr were going to cram in a filming in there, but didn't. So it could be right around then. But it's like, I mean, I could say around the holidays, like, yeah, they could end up street racing because there is stuff that goes down. But it's like, would they want to? And it's just like, again, too, it gets to the point of like trying not to get burned out. Like, that's a big thing with a lot of this stuff. Like, you don't want to do it every single thing last out. Like, with me, make my videos. I've actually thought about this before, like how I've, I kept the same excitement and energy with making all these videos for the past, what, almost six years now. It's because I like other things as well. There's other things I like to do. It's not 100% all, like, you can see, like, I got all this shit back here. I like all kinds of stuff. And it's like, it, it's finding that balance. So it's like, when these guys have that time off, it's like, do they really want to go go out and race? Especially because with the ca their cars as well, the cars probably need work. They probably got stuff to do to them. They need refreshing and stuff. So it's like, I understand why this a lot of the Street Outlaw guys, we may not see them on the streets with their Street Outlaw cars, we'll say. But still, it brings up a question. It's like, that that's going to be an issue again. We're going to see as time goes on with a lot of the these next couple of years, I assume, with more people come, new faces, I'll say, to Street Outlaws. It's like, well, we've never seen this guy on the street. Well, it's like, when was the last time we saw any of these guys on the street? Then, yeah, sure, yes, you started here. They have other cars, and I'm going to get into that. Like, yes, they have. Other cars are exactly like that. They got the small tire cars. They got the daily driver cars. Kai Kelly's got 18 different big tire Camaros that he can go out and race at any moment. Then you look at someone like Memphis, though. It's like the Memphis crew there. It, like, all if they're not at a JJ's arm drop or some event, there's some Facebook live of them sometime throughout the week on Facebook of them out street racing. Like, when you look at someone like, I, see, I don't want to start picking out names insane people but like memphis is the only ones you really see consistently doing it and one of the reasons with that is probably because they're not running no prep kings they're not in that level of series where it's has to show up every single week so maybe that see again this it just everything's coming back to, every time we talk about a street topic now it comes back to how no prep kings impacts it even to where like i'm not even trying to talk about that right now i'm talking at trying to talk about the the street got what guys actually race on the street and we're still tying no prep kings in this good god but the thing the question i don't think should be how many of the guys these guys do still street race i think it better be how many of these guys would go out in the street race i'm gonna end it on that